morning. Today I am going on a beach cleanup because I haven't been in a beach cleanup for such a long time and I need to do something good. I'm still feeling a little bit sick, however, I really want to go because a lot of my friends will be going and for her, hopefully it will be nice to actually um, go outside and play a little bit at the beach while we clean up. I'm still feeling a little bit sick, but that's fine. Um, have another, have a lot of things to do today. I was just cleaning all morning. It's been so messy here and I've been trying to keep up with laundry and everything, but I'm excited for a day of a lot of tasks, but also some good ones. So, and I'll take you along. Oh, look at all this laundry. I don't know, so much. And upstairs, down here, keeping on working. <laughs> So actually, I have this really cute thing for me. Yeah, good girl. Sit. Yeah. Oh, no paw needed. <laughs> Sit down. You want this or this? That or this? This or the other way? No, 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 no. Come here. Sit down. Lila. It's a little bit hard for her this morning. <sighs> Looks so cute on her. My aunt made that. Me show you. Hmm? Do you look cute? Sure you do. Now we're ready to go. <laughs> the brick. Mm, thank you. The, the German vegan butter, by the way. Really? Yeah. Mm. Dude, that tastes like real butter. Right? Oh. <laughs> hey, let me get the blanket. Are there plastics we use? Uh, it's pretty wild. I mean, we've been on this planet for like hundred thousand years us as humans and only in the last hundred years have has plastic been around and now like basically 90% of the fish have plastic in their bodies and you know it goes up the food chain basically means 90% of us have like microplastic in our bodies and I think it's good, it's good to be cautious, like, cautious about like what we're doing every day. I think it's really cool too this day and age like we've only had like this connectivity with social media like as of the recent days. Anyone right now could bust out their phone and like thousands of people could just watch your story and like see and that could really change you know so stoked all you guys are here and um you know i think we all have a similar vision of just like keeping this amazing planet like clean you know i think hawaii is a great example of this but there's other places in the world that are like heavily impacted by the trash and it's pretty <laughs> So we just finished the beach cleanup, which was great, right? It was wonderful. <laughs> that was actually good. What? So I'm hot, get the car moving, no AC. <laughs> Leela thought it was fun for sure. She met a bunch oh, of friends. So naughty though. Yeah, she was kind of naughty, but she had fun. So oh, that was good. And now we're heading back. Beautiful. Just got to the farm. Really excited. I didn't have a leash, so I had to literally put the other way around. <laughs> but yeah, we are ready for the farm. We're right. We just got here to this beautiful farm, 
and it's our friends. It's really nice because they have a lot of like fruit trees and um, taro and like those little lakes everywhere. Streams, not lakes. But it's really gorgeous. The nicest part of this property is that it is so big and she really needs to run around so that's perfect. I don't have to kind of walk her, she just likes to walk around and explore. It's the best part. Um, I love taking her up here. Besides, they have a bunch of bananas that we're hopefully gonna get for some smoothies. Oof! You see them? So nice. I love it up here. Like 16 months, 14, 16 months for it to grow. So you're like really caring for this for about a year, right? Like so much. So it takes a whole year just and, to get to that size? Oh yeah, over a year. Oh so really? When I was like harvesting it, I was like, ah! <laughs> oh, God. Like I felt like I was killing my, my babies. Wow, I didn't know that it takes so long. So you just eat the root from it, right? Yep. Oh, sexy. <laughs> right. Ready for anything. <laughs> <laughs> but get that you have the slippers on. Leela, give me the ball. Give me the ball. Come here. No? And everybody thinks when you live in Hawaii, everything's for free, like fruit-wise, but they're so expensive in the store. So I'm lucky that they have some oop, um, fresh papayas that we're gonna pick and some bananas. We just found the apple picker, the uh, papaya picker. Oh. <laughs> Not cut out for this guy. Not cut out for the whole <laughs> Oh my gosh, she literally went like, put my phone down. No. Man, that was a close one though. Like, <laughs> at least I bumped it up. So you're, going, hey. <laughs> you're not part of this. I don't think I hire you. Ooh. Dude, it's like all the way over. <laughs> Sharp this camera, isn't that insane? Look at the bird up there. Okay, second one, the bananas. <laughs> it looks kind of heavy though, man. Oh, it is. Dude, <laughs> no, not that. My phone. <gasps> oh my god, okay, okay, okay. okay wait, wait, let me grab it, let me grab it. Okay. Oh, jeez. Okay, here we go. Wasn't that bad. Now we got the bananas. Oh, we gotta take the whole thing down. God, thank God I got the right one. Ah. So that was the last one. Carried all the papayas back up here. It's so beautiful. I don't know, I can not describe it like. We just finished a little bit of work here on the farm. And I have to say, it's so gorgeous. Like the light, everything here is so blissful and beautiful. And after a long day of work, it's nice to get here and get some gardening down out of the city where I have to go to school which is not so nice and be with my little doggy Lila, come here. um yeah I really like oh baby oh hello how are you how are you how are you you, you huh how beautiful you are <laughs> you like him um 
this is really something I can recommend you if you are always in the city or you always have to go to the city like myself. I live kind of in the countryside, but I have to go to the city every day for school and I do work. Yeah? Sorry. Um, I really recommend you to go outside and I know not everybody lives in Hawaii, but I'm sure there are like a forest. There are like places outside that you can go like to a lake or forest or something that is more connected to nature because it really makes a difference and kind of like clears your mind um, after a long day. So that's what I did. A lot of times I'm too tired, but today I felt like going, so that was good.